back to my father as a minister. He baptized me when I was four years old. Mm. You know, so like I tell mm. everybody, I didn't just jump to God just a couple of years ago and hope yeah. somebody to give me a movie part. I've been a child of God. But the only thing, <laughs> see, see, with Hollywood, you know, it was the thing with Hollywood. They would ask other actors when we were doing the 18. They say, mm -hmm. do it bother you that Mr. T always talked about God? Because I'm playing my, my, my tapes from Chicago mm -hmm. to, keep me, to keep me surrounded by the word, you see, because right. it's so easy for me to forget about God, yeah, you well, know. Yeah. So, and, and, and they couldn't deal with that. Mm -hmm. So, like I said, so when my father baptized me when I was four years old and I was five and six, I used to carry my father's Bible. Yeah. Like I tell you, I was my father's Bible bearer. Mm -hmm. I used to go with my father. I don't care where he's going. I just wanted to go. Mm -hmm. You know, I would hold his so Bible. So he, he was going to go preach someplace. You would take yeah, the Bible. Yeah. I'll be holding the Bible. Mm -hmm. See, when I go to church, when I go to church, I come, like I tell people, I'm in church for one reason. I'm a sinner trying to be saved. I'm not a celebrity making a guest appearance. I need God to hold me to the next week. Because mm -hmm. when I get the word from God, I'm like a sponge in church. I get the word. I fill up with God. Mm -hmm. Then I go down and take it where the people don't want to hear God. Mm -hmm. I take it to the valley. Take it around the people doing drugs. and whatnot. When they can hear, they don't go to God. And they hear it from me mm -hmm. at the gym when I'm working out. Hey, T, how you doing? God bless you, brother. You know, mm -hmm. simple thing, then mm -hmm. slowly they'll come back to see, yeah, you know, mm -hmm. I heard you talk about God, you know, could you tell me some more things? That's what it's about. Mm, that's what it's about. You know, so that's, I, that's why my prayer, I say, God, use me. So that's my prayer. I get up. I say, God, give me strength today. Not strength so I can lift 500 pounds, but give me strength so when I speak, my words can motivate, can inspire somebody, can give somebody hope. That's what it's about. That's what it's about. That's the reason why we in church. I said, I really want to say, Mr. T, a sinner, but saved by grace. Yes. 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 Because we all have sinned and fallen short of God's glory. That's why we're here in church. None of us is perfect. So if God is for me, who in the world can be against me? message to a lot of you out there. Don't get sidetracked. I know you out there, you, you dealing in sin and all that. We all been in sin. We all have sin and fallen short of the glory of God. But enough of the sinning. It's time to come back home. It's time to come back home. Because, because you know as well as I know, sin is only pleasure for a season. Pleasure for a season. And now if you're done, you're left out there, you go too far and you stay too long. So don't make God your last choice. Make God your first choice.